What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome to the channel. Long time no see. I am Demarius Jackson. I've been gone a little bit of time just because I've actually moved to Japan. Check out the view uh, from my new house here. There it is. I hear some kids uh, playing down there. Great view, very inspiring. Anyway, so in today's video, we're going to talk about a couple of things that you can use as I call them filler material. They're kind of just good things to practice for technique, but sometimes I use them as kind of filler material in between different ideas that I have. So without further ado, let's get straight to it. So the first idea are descending minor seconds. So I'll have my usual uh, demonstration PDF in my description. You can also look at it below here on the screen. It sounds a little bit like this. and so on and so forth with whatever instrument that it is that it is that you're playing. All right, so here's an example of how I would use it in a tune. Hopefully you can hear very easily uh, throughout all the notes and get a feel for what exactly it would sound like uh, for me playing it at least. So that next variation is descending minor thirds. It sounds a little bit like this. Etc. Etc. Now I got this variation actually from Kenny Garrett. I was uh, transcribing him many, many years ago. And sometimes he plays it just as you hear it. Sometimes, like I said, I, I use it as filler and he would use it from one idea to another. But there it is, it's descending minor thirds. Here's an example of how I would use it in a tune. example of filler material is going to be simply playing around the circle of fourth. So if you don't know what that is, I'll just quickly describe it. I'll start on my G. I'm thinking of the major scale. So G, I go up to the fourth note in the G major scale, which is the C. And then I'm in the C major scale, go up to the fourth note of that, which is F natural. Fourth note of F natural major scale is B flat and so on and so forth. So forth. It sounds like this. <laughs> And then obviously the notes repeat themselves. So here's an example of how I would use that in a tune, kind of as filler material. There you have it. Those are just a few ideas, uh, things, filler material, if you will, or just good things to practice for technique on whatever horn that you uh, play. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. Like, comment, subscribe, do all those things, and I'll see you on the next one out.